Hey guys, I'm back. So today I recorded my contour routine. Um, it's just a basic contour that I always do for a night out um, and during the day as well. And for this I used my Sosur. So so for this I used my Sosi contour palette and I'm in love with it lately. I've been talking about it lots of times, you all know that I love it, of course. Um, I haven't actually done a video using it yet. So this is it and it's $29.95, you can buy it on her website or you can buy it from pharmacies as well, I know McCabe's definitely, definitely sell it. Starting off, I just have my brows filled in with the NYX Tame and Frame Brow Gel in Blonde and that's mixed with MAC Brow Gel in Deep Dark Brunette. And um, I used my Real Techniques angled brush to fill them in, as always, and then I just have a tiny bit of mascara on my eyes, it's the Penny's PS Pro range. And I'm going to use a beauty blender, it's absolutely manky and I've dampened it obviously, um, to apply my foundation. So I'm going to use Stila Stay All Day Foundation and this is in the shade Buff, number 7. It's a really nice shade for wearing with tan. Applied. I'm going to go ahead and use my So Su palette. I am obsessed with this lately. I'm starting off here with my cream contour. This is shade number one, the lightest shade in the So Su palette, and I'm using this to mark out the lighter shades of my face. So once I've got everywhere marked out, I then blend, 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 blend and blend with my gorgeous beauty blender. I don't know what I would do without beauty blenders. I'm in love. I didn't get them at the start, but since I started dampening them. This particular beauty blender is from Real Techniques and I find it really, really good. I'm not sure. I haven't tried other ones. I've tried the Penny's ones and I wasn't as impressed. They weren't as soft. The softer they are, the better. Next, I'm going in with shade number four. This is kind of a mid-tone sort of cream contour and it's only a little bit darker than my foundation, I'd say, when I've tan on, but I use this to start contouring my face. I put it in all the contour places, basically. I'm now taking quite a flat brush, this one's from Morphe and I'm going to use it for shade number two and this is the darkest cream contour shade, I'm going to use this obviously to contour my face.
back in with my beauty blender and my brush and I'm blending everything back in together. Blending is of course the most important part about contour and palette. It's so so easy to blend, that's what I love about the cream contouring. Now taking shade 3, I'm using this to set all of the places that we used shade 1. to finish up our contour I'm taking shade 5 this is a lovely brown bronzer and it's matte so it's gorgeous and of course I'm just going over all the contoured parts to set them for my favorite favorite part it's time for highlight and we're gonna take shade five it's amazing I love this highlighter Now you just intensify that highlighter even more, I go in with my Fave Powder Highlight and this is the BAM's Mary Luminizer. It's absolutely gorgeous, it's slightly bronzy and it's really natural glow but it's quite intense as well so you can build it up for a night out. I'm now going to apply my Kylie Lip Kit in Candy K. This is my first time trying it and I was actually really, really impressed. I love the colour of it and I don't usually like a kind of pink undertone, but I'd seen it before, obviously, on Kylie and loved it on her. So I was like, I mean, I'll chance it. I'm no Kylie, but. And I was really impressed. So yeah, before I put this on, I just removed my lip balm that I had on. I slightly patted off because it applies a lot better and stays much better and then I of course just applied this, I didn't bother with a lip balm or anything. So guys we're coming to the end of the video now, I hope you enjoyed, I really enjoyed doing it as usual, I'm obsessed with doing my contour, it's my favourite step by far, I love skin. <laughs> also just quickly before I go, I just wanted to remind you that I have a huge giveaway over on my Instagram, it includes a lot of my favourite beauty products, so check it out! That's it for me and I'll see you in my next video.